Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the Experience Project 13.0 running Android 9.0 Pi for our Redmi Note 5 Pro. So, without wasting more time, let's start. Starting with the home screen, we get the same old pixel launcher. You can see like basic settings. This is the basic pixel launcher. Then we have this Google Now support also in the left side of the launcher. We get this all like AOSP apps as this is based on AOSP and also this retro music, this weather and you also get the Chrome as default browser. Then let's go into settings, into system, about phone and here into uh, Android version we get this uh, experience project. You can see Android 9, 13.0 version, experience version and 5 October 28 in patch. I don't know why a lot of like it's a lot of like, older patch and you can see January 4 is the build date but still the October patch is there so maybe the experience team has not yet updated to the latest security patch and also you can see experience code name Roseway so I don't know what is that thing and yeah you can see UK experience so the kernel also by any experience day because let's start with the customization so first we get this uh, experience project default wallpaper and you can see the red theme is applied as default as that's the red theme of the ROM and then let's move into experience settings and you can see we have a lot of settings here first is Alisa custom kernel features but it doesn't work then we have here buttons buttons customization very few options are there in like all of the tabs you can see display only weather then status bar you have status bar battery icon and stuff then status bar items like all of the items you can also enable headset if you want then we have the net activity net refer, uh, network traffic uh, status bar on the more than that you have this lock screen stuff face auto unlock fingerprint unlock even after the reboot then miscellaneous nothing nav settings and power menu options so no, a lot of stuff is missing and also a lot of stuff like they are like not updated with it's the security patch it's january and they are still with october so maybe they should merge the latest security patch to avoid any things like going between google always updates the security uh, like security patches after like two three days so and also the roms do it like after google does and yeah it depends on like if it's an aosp rom or lineage rom but this is an ASP ROM and the source is really old so maybe you can use this like you can use this as your daily driver but the source is really old so maybe you can like just if you want uh, to use this on your Redmi Note 5 Pro you can use this also the PUBG performance is really good so I'm going to also show you guys how good is the PUBG performance in this uh, like review so yeah let's Keep this so guys I'm playing with the HD graphics so let me show you into settings graphics and you can see I've set it to HD and high and HDR doesn't work on our device also the style is movie mode so yeah I love that style and you can see the performance is really great so that's the lobby um, yeah, I won't play this full match I will just skip to some parts so let's fall this is like war mode I've been playing you can see for now the graphics are really good you can see while running uh, shooting enemies it's really good like it's not that bad but yeah it's okay and there are no glitches still now I'm just playing here wandering around these houses if there are any inside you can see oh my god it, he was already dead so there are maybe a lot of people here oh my god you can see the sky uh, it's not paying attention to us. You can see. Uh, okay, got a kill. <laughs> okay, so guys, uh, that's it for this uh, PUBG performance. Now let's check the Antidu benchmark. Yes, finally, the Antidu test is done, and this is the score: one lakh thirteen thousand two twenty four. So I have not like compared it with, but this is the score for this ROM which is the experience project and you guys can check it and compare it with the other ROMs. And guys that's it for the experience project 13.0 running Android 9 or Pi on our Redmi Note 5 Pro and I've given you all PUBG performance, the Android benchmark, everything and also the fair review of this. Also this battery uh, it's holding up good but it's not that 
well because of maybe the old sources and some old stuff inside the rom but yeah it's quite a good and also suitable for usage like daily usage so that's a logo here and yeah guys uh, that's it uh, bye bye if you guys have liked this video you can press the like button if not then the dislike button and for more videos on the redmi note 5 pro or the redmi note 5 ai you can subscribe this channel and also press the bell icon if you want notifications and bye bye nothing else bye bye